Good morning, Highway family. Today is Sunday, March 23rd, 2014. My name is Jim, and welcome to the 10 Before 10. Whether it's giving or going, here at Highway, we are all about missions. Through our Assemblies of God World Missions, the Gospel is being preached, and the Kingdom of God is advancing. Watch this video about what God is doing all around the world through our AG missionaries. The challenges of daily living in Central Africa can make life anywhere else seem easy. People in the Democratic Republic of the Congo struggle with issues that we generally take for granted in the West. So the church is reaching out to meet needs and share the love of Christ. People struggle with malaria. It's the number one killer of children under the age of five here in Kinshasa. We see a lot of malaria. We see a lot of deaths from malaria. People here struggle a lot, and there's not a lot of resources for them once they're sick to, to get better. Pat and Suzanne Hurst are partnering with the Congolese National Church by training and equipping them to reach the lost within their neighborhoods. When we can come into a community and we can, in very practical ways, uh, mobilize uh, the church to express in very tangible ways the love of Christ by touching uh, needs, it's at that point then we gain the confidence of the people in the community and then we win the right to be heard and at that point then they will accept and they will listen to our message. One outreach in the capital city of Kinshasa not only improved the lives of those in the community, but brought many to Christ. They went door to door and they just did a, a simple outreach where they were given a mosquito net, they were explained how to use it, how to hang it up, and then the whole thing was tied in with the Word of God, that God loves you. We as a church love you because the love of Christ compels us and therefore that's why we're doing this program. <laughs> The mosquito net outreach was a big success. After we gave out the nets, this area saw a big decline in cases of malaria. We were able to win many people to Christ. I am thankful for the mosquito nets we got from the church. My children and I are much healthier now, and we haven't been to the hospital since we received the nets. I accepted Christ and now attend the church faithfully. The people in the community of this particular church were incredibly touched that the church went beyond its normal methods of evangelism and actually addressed an issue that they were struggling with. The people see that and it's, it's had an incredible impact on the church and the community as a whole. Good morning, Highway family. Today is Sunday, March 23rd, 2014. My name is Jim, and welcome to the 10 Before 10. Ever wonder who prepares all the amazing meals we enjoy here at Highway? Or who comes in early to make sure the communion trays are set up just right? Well, the answer is our Benevolence Ministry. Watch this. Good morning, Highway family. Today is Sunday, March 23rd, 2014. My name is Jim, and welcome to the 10 Before 10. Coming this May is the annual Men's Rally. This year's guest speakers will be men of God such as Coach Mike Singletary, the chaplains for the Indianapolis Colts and Baltimore Ravens, as well as Phil Robertson from Duck Dynasty. You can be a part of this great event by joining the Combined Men's Choir. 
Here's a message from our choir liaison, Lauren Dickinson. Men of Highway, we guys, we guys talk frequently about being faithful men of God, about putting our faith in the forefront and not on the back burner, about being the leaders that God has designed us to be, both in our families and in the community. It's time to put that talk into action. On Saturday, May 3rd, we have an amazing opportunity to step up to the plate in a Christ-like manner. The men's rally in the valley will be held at the Cavelli Center that day from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. The speakers include Mike Singletary, Pro Football Hall of Fame linebacker, and Phil and Al Robertson of Duck Dynasty fame. How can the men of Highway Tabernacle be part of this? First of all, be there. The cost is $30 per wristband. It's absolutely worth it. Second, join the 300 voice Gideon's Crew Choir. We are looking for 300 men who love to praise the Lord, who will sing two songs and have three rehearsals. All of them are at Highway. The first is tomorrow night at 6 p.m. This is for the men of Highway Tabernacle only. Highway Tabernacle will pay $5 of the $30 fee if you'll agree to sing in the choir. So text me, call me, or email me, and I'll tighten you up. Love you, Highway. Good morning, Highway family. Today is Sunday, March 23rd, 2014. My name is Jim and welcome to the 10 Before 10. Attention seniors, we will be starting our ministry time at 10.30 a.m. Please make note of this time change. Next Sunday, March 30th, our very own New York Dream Center missions team will be having a fundraiser after service in the Family Life Center. The cost of the meal is $7 for those eight and over. Four to seven years of age are $3 and three and under are free. Come support our student missions team. Our Blue Skies missions team will be selling apple pies on April 13th. These pies cost $10. Enjoy a great dessert and support missions. Attention all of those who are part of the Passion Play cast. Rehearsals are upon us. There is a big rehearsal March 29th this Saturday for all of our new cast and townspeople. This rehearsal starts at 9 a.m. Lunch will be provided and will end around 2 p.m. Grab a calendar on your way out if you haven't yet. It truly is an exciting time here at Highway. Lastly, in Passion Play news, next Sunday we will be clearing the stage in preparations for building our Passion Play set. After the lunch on Sunday, we will be asking men to stay behind and help clear the platform. If you are available, see Pastor Matt or Joe Posey. There are a lot of great things going on here at Highway. Remember to check your bulletin for these events and other happenings. Or you can check us out on the web at www.highwayfamily.com. You can also connect with us on Facebook by searching Highway Tabernacle Church. Now, don't forget, today and every day, we are a family.